your tulips in a twist. Hand up, boss, like communists. No, I can never ever get back all the things I missed. But I'm that man, they think you've got the gist. Put your tulips in a twist. Hand up, boss, like communists. No, I can never ever get back all the things I missed. Boys who were awake at six, we snuck away from other boys who were still asleep. They probably want to come, but if they're still asleep, it's all good. And yeah, we'll try and get some fish to take back just in the morning now. And then once we get back, we'll go for a dive or something and have some breakfast. But we thought we'd just go for the early morning run and see if we can get fish. Josh is on, first fish of the day. The jiggy jig. Very small. The world's smallest, whatever that is. Emperor. Nice release, Josh. Jed's on, second fish of the day. Coral fish. Look at that sunrise. Get your merch, www.offshoreadventures.com.au. Yeah, mate. Just bring me the fish. Oh, oh yes. Trouty! Oh, nice, dude. <laughs> Look at that. That's what we want. The tiny little jig, too. Perfect eating size trout from Jed. First one on the trip on the rod for him. He's stoked. Proven to catch more fish. Good fish, Good stop fish. him, stop him. Get him up, Josh. Come on, oh, big man. In the sunrise. He's <laughs> <laughs> getting railed. <laughs> yeah, baby. That's a good fish, whatever it is. If it's a trout, it's going to be an absolute cracker. Yes. He's up from the reef a little bit. Look at those head shakes. What are you calling, Josh? Big trout. Dude, that's a big whatever it is. I don't know if it's a trout eh? I reckon it's some sort of pelagian. Mackie? Oh, it's a Mackie. Sick. Oh, Still going, that's not a trout. Dusted. A trout wouldn't fight at this high in the water column. Oh. Bro, this is good. <laughs> I'm getting smacked. Easy. Looks oh, it's a Chinese. Chinese. Yeah, baby. That thing went hard. Oh, that's sick. That's a big Chinese. Oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> Big Chinaman. Oh, the sun's rising. We'll see if he swims. We can't really do much if he doesn't swim, but. Go on. That was a brilliant release. That's what he does. First fish for me for the morning. I saw some shit on the sound on the bottom, so I dropped it back down. Big fast. Nice. That's what we want, boys. That is a good one. Oh, holy <laughs> that's wow. stonker. Holy shit. Yeah, Not baby. Much. Jed with the tiny little micro jig, 60 grammer. Sweet as, that's an absolute cracker. So we'll be taking those boys for a nice feed. Cheering. Yeah, baby. Good fish. Just said we're on a little rise and I got whacked. This is screaming. I think Jed's on the bottom where he's on a little good fish. But I'm on a little good trout, I reckon. Oh, I might not be sure. I think I've got my jig back. What do you got, mate? Oh. Big cod. Spangled. Oh, purple, purple cod! cod. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. Get him in the boat! Get him in! <laughs> He's been eating something. Yeah! <laughs> oh, Look at that. He's purple cod, so I suppose they're really good eating, so we'll chuck him in the esky in the back here, and we'll get a pretty good feed. I just got a crack a hit. It's a good fish, I don't know if it's a trout. You got a chiny? <laughs> Hopefully. Oh, this out of here. Not, mate. Still going. I'm just using the Stratic 6000 on the grappler. Might be onto a nice GT there. Oh. Still going. Still going all the way to the top. I'm calling Chiny. Big China. Oh, 
Jesus. Is that the same China? I reckon that's Josh's, eh? Look at that. First ever Chinaman on the rod. That Look at the hook. Crazy. Look at where Josh's hook was. It actually was. is. It's actually the same Chinese. It looks like it. Look, it's got a hook, hook mark. So it looks exactly. like it could be the exact same fish. Got a hook mark on the other side. Hook's just come out. That thing went hard. Look at that. Absolute beast of the reef. Big Chinaman. Can't eat these guys, so we'll chuck them back. Thank you for a good fight, mate. Boom. Great release. Josh is on. Giving it some. Jesus. Oh, this is the Chinese again. <laughs> I'll test your knots. Saxon tied both of them. <laughs> oh, big head shakes again. This is a Chinese for sure. It looks like it. Oh, there's some colour. You got it up quick this time. I mean, it's his third time, so. I bet you it's the same fish. Mangrove Jack, I think. Oh, no, nah, Chinaman. I'd be really upset if you saw that. Oh, nah, it's a different one. Yeah, smaller. it's a bit smaller, yeah. Gone. Chuck him back. Oh. Oh. Come on, mate. He'll ride himself. He'll be right. Jed's on. What are you calling, mate? Nice. Throat emperor, sweet, nice little red throat emperor for Jed. Chuck him back, he's one size. I think you got my jig too. I think you got my jig. Oh, big cod. Jed with the big gold spot cod, chuck him back. Toby's birthday today. Pretty good birthday present. Free trip to the Wit Sundays. Happy birthday, brother! Thanks, brother. <laughs> Just trying to find you. <laughs> good luck, boys. So the boys are going for a fish again. I gave one GoPro to use to hopefully get some fish. Then Paul even said we might get the boat off the top. So us boys can go for a dive or a fish as well. So we have heaps of content. We'll see how those boys go and we'll try and get some fish as well. And we got no clouds in the sky, blue water, and not much wind. So it should be an epic day. I think it's just gonna get better and better. So yeah, we're stoked. The boys are off. Birthday fish! Birthday Let's fish! Go. Yeah! Come on, boys. Yeah. That's a cobia! Is it? Is it? That's it's a, a cobia! Hey! <laughs> no way. Oh my god! Get him in, get him in, get him in! Yes! yes! Birthday cobia! Birthday cobia! On the snatcher. Bro, that was a mean double hookup, G. We got a cobia on the jig. First drop on the birthday. It's a fing shot. Getting hot. Oh, yeah. Stop him before he gets down, boy. Get him. Get him, boy. Pump him. On the snatchers. On the snatcher. Get him. Get him some wine on him. There he is, Kala. Bajit to Valley. Oh, look at that. Spangled! Spangled!
angle do they got to eat them? Yeah, boy. Happy birthday, Tobes. <laughs> you got my line, bro. You got my line. Yeah. Color. Is that red? Is that red? Tiny. Tiny moon! Yeah! Tiny! Woo! Another rasp, man. That's a big rasp. You got his line. Boys, go back a bit. Oh, you're on, you're on! Get him, hands up, boys! Woo! And he's having a run. I don't know, on the good jig, bud. On the good jig? On the good jig. Oh! The Russ! Double on Russ! <laughs> Big Russ! Big, Big Russ! I got straightened out. Gotta use the snatcher. The snatcher, you gotta use the, the offshore snatcher. adventure snatcher. It held, hooks held up proper well. G'day guys, I hope you're enjoying part two of the Wit Sunday trip. It's an absolutely mental episode coming up, but I just wanna say the new snatchers are now available on www.offshoreadventures.com.au. I'm having free shipping on the site for a couple more weeks. Whatever you buy, if you spend 10 bucks or you spend 110 bucks, free shipping all around the shop. Uh, these are $9.99, come in 40, 60, and 80 grams of four different colors. They absolutely slayed up in Queensland, as you guys have been seeing. So, yeah, get on and grab a couple bargains. I'm also going to be shipping out a couple jigs to a few special people if you like and comment on this episode and send me proof on instagram at offshore underscore underscore adventures so yeah make sure you leave a like and comment and go in the draw to win a few jigs and maybe a merch pack anyway i hope you enjoy this episode and fingers crossed you'll be the lucky winner Phew. paul's trusting us with his brand new tender what is it paul uh, so it's a boat designed by bill wright who's a famous uh, boat builder and designer in australia and it was built by a bloke called Ian Eastgate, who's a legendary uh, boat builder. It's all handmade, made out of timber. Um, you know, everything uh, that you see Ian made. Pretty crazy little tender. I know it's worth a lot of money, and he's trusting us with it, but we'll be careful. Like Even just little things like that is just insane. And yeah, it's wooden. It does look fiberglass, but it's actually wooden. And it's got the gel coat on the outside, so it's nice and light. I think that's why it's made out of wood instead of fiberglass. That is hectic. They sent a couple GT, so hopefully they can get onto some good fish. Literally one minute of being in the water, the boys, I think Josh and Saxon have both speared a fish. So we'll head over now, see what they got. Oh, no, nah, Harry. Nice parrot. Beautiful parrot. I'll just grab Harry's fish. Nice, mate. Thanks, mate. Nice Spangled Emperor by Harry. Get him in the esky. It's about a good four kilo Spangled. Good, probably two and a half kilo. Just got a fish. Yeah, baby. That's like easy six kilo coral trout. Look at that coral trout. Wow. All right, get into them.
<laughs> you see it? I waited for it to poke his face out good, and then just stoned <laughs> it. <laughs> Big red throat, red bro. That's my first one and I'm stoked. Beautiful. Nice stone shot. Put a mouth on him. Get him in the esky. Some more. <laughs> First cray from the reef. You're allowed to shoot these guys, so you can just shoot them straight in the face and they're really spiny, but they'll be delicious. Look at the size of that trout. Yoo-hoo! Beauty, bro. That's a cracker. I had my gun loaded to like <laughs> half a band. <laughs> Today's dive, we absolutely slayed them. Crays, big trout, and some emperors and stuff. But we filled the esky so quick in the new boat. We're trying not to get blood on it, but we definitely christened the new boat. We're gonna empty the esky, come back here and try and Put the crays get some more fish. Yeah. And yeah, hopefully we can get some more crays as well. But it's so cool here, there's so much current. You don't really have to kick in it. You just go down, find a cray or find a fish in the shallows, shoot it, and then bring it out. And then you just cover so much ground like that. And it's clear, it's beautiful, and yeah, Just the scenes are actually way. immaculate. Mahoki's over there, so we'll head over there and come back in a bit. But yeah, what a awesome well, session already. It's crazy how much water's moving in here. You gotta remember, you're in the middle of the ocean. It looks so shallow, it's so beautiful, but you're in the middle of the ocean, you're out past the shoal, and you get stuck and you, in that current, you get lost. Like, it'd be a miracle to get found. <laughs> We just jumped in at the third spot, came back out from Mahoki. It was pretty dead, it was Jed, Josh and I, and yeah, it was pretty dead, we didn't really see much. I said I wasn't gonna be boaty because this is kind of my trip and the boys are here because of me, but at the end of the day, it's fair, everyone takes turns, everyone gets the same amount of diving. Big trouty, trout king. Nice. Big coral trout. Beautiful day out here. We smashed the fish on the spear today, which was good compared to yesterday. And the boys who took the tin out smashed it on the rods, on the jigs and stuff like that. And a few of them were the offshore adventure snatches. So if you want yours, the link will be below if you want to buy a few snatches. They do work really well and I have designed them. The fish are filleted and they're in the freezer and Jed and Saxon are going to take the tinny out for top water GT or something because where we were diving earlier we did see a few GT shark mackerel stuff like that which will take a popper and then once it cools down a bit some of the other boys might take the other boat out for a jig or something similar. But yeah it's an absolutely beautiful day and Got really good conditions with diving and fishing. Good luck, mate. Thanks, mate. Appreciate it. They hit so hard, eh? That's a real gun. Might even start the motor, you reckon? Yeah. Yeah, little boy. Woohoo! It's a nice one. Oh, he's a nice one. Oh, he's a nice one. Oh, he's about hooked. Yeah. Oh, no. It's in his mouth. Yeah, baby. All right, get out there again quick. On a golden. Oh, bludger. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo! Yee-hoo-hoo! 
on you, brother. Yeah, boys. Yes. <laughs> Double up. Here he is. Small fish, but. Oh. <laughs> They're Saxons. While the boys are jigging for coral trout, the real men are out here popping for teeth. Bit of a swim. Yeah, yeah what a brute. Give us a rundown. How'd we go? Well, we got all. That's about it. Anyway. Back to my gear we go. Boat number one made it just no good. Boat number two, first GT, how, how are you feeling? Yeah, not bad, that was good. I didn't actually think the boys would get GTs, but they said they got three GTs, one bludger, Trevally, and lost to Spanish. Jeff Saxon, what do we have for dinner? Oh, uh, tonight we've got mangrove jack, red emperor, crayfish, and enchiladas. A few chips as well. Should be a good little feast. Keen, mate. Just getting oh, your protein mate. in tonight. Lobster, Red Emperor, Mangrove Jack, Chips, and we'll miss some Paul, but I think he's asleep. He had some dinner earlier. But it's Toby's birthday. Toby's a good mate of mine, and he just cracked a... Oh, you cracked a Coke? What are you doing, man? <laughs> <laughs> this experience itself, thanks to Mohegan Gun Charlie, is just insane. Being able to bring some of my best mates, Jed, Josh, hey. Saxon, Toby, and some winners that are now good mates, Adam and Josh, and Ethan, who's left. Amazing decky onto this and just catch fish, be out here is just insane. We've got beautiful weather and yeah, I'll get a beer for Toby. What fish did you catch today for your birthday that you've never caught before? We've got a cobia, we've got a Chinaman's fish, Spangled Emperor. I'll just go with you, mate. Um, Come on, song, boys. Song. Let's go. It's <laughs> a baby. He's true, boy. He's a fish pipe through and through. He's a bastard, so they say. You're about to go to heaven, but he went the other way, he went down. Down, down. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Let's go! Anyway, happy birthday, Toby. <laughs> Thanks, Mark. Hope everyone enjoys, and I hope everyone at home is enjoying this episode because being out here is just insane. Anyway, dinner served. Let's, Let's have a cheers, boys. End up with a you. I, guess, I, I don't have a drink, <laughs> but. <laughs> 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 Thanks, mate. <laughs> it's a beautiful morning out here, and we're getting the big, heavy setups ready. We are gonna head out in the tinny, and after seeing Jed and Saxon get a few bangers last night off the top, we thought we'd give it a go this morning before breakfast. It's absolute glass off this morning, but it doesn't get much better than this. We went stick bait and caught absolutely nothing. We did see a big mackerel jump so high in the air, which is pretty cool. Want to walk us through what you've got here, Harry? One hook, I've got a baby cod of some sort. Another hook, I've got a bit of the reef. I'll just put a 20 gram jig on. There's absolutely no drift, no current, no wind. Let's go back there. Oh, there's more. First fish. Getting First battered. fish from an accident. We ran out of fuel, <laughs> so we stopped here, <laughs> marked a few fish, and thought we might as well drop. Oh, oh spewing. Well, he's gone. Oh, not first fish. Some big marks on the sounder. Big red. Even play it when it's on the surface. I think it's a rasp. Oh. Big head shape. Good colour. Big rasp. <laughs> 
Holy! Oh. <laughs> That's a big one. Big Mary Rass for Josh. I can get this hook out. Oh, Dart, just send him back. What a beautiful fish. Gorgeous. First proper fish for me. On the 20 grammer. Oh, it's a wrasse. First Maori wrasse for me, but. On the jiggy jig. First Maori wrasse for me. These are protected species in Queensland, but they're too pretty to keep anyway. See you, mate. Adam just lost my last snatcher, so we had to put on. Oh, that's a, a different jig. A Mac Tunner. Okay, I reckon I reckon something else, eh? Yeah, I don't oh, doubles. doubles. The winner's got a double. Chasing donkeys. He's getting <laughs> oh, smart. Getting... I reckon you got sharked, then. Oh. Oh. I reckon Adam got sharked. No, I don't know which way I am. I'm over, I'm over. You're it. Yeah, the tree. <laughs> That's good. We're drifting for once. Oh, there we go. Did you get your jig? No. Yeah, yeah. Did you get your fish back? No, bro. <laughs> oh, oh, it bit it on the way up. What is it? <laughs> Still got it. Charles is showing off. Let it turn into a shark. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's still a fish. It's in the corner. <laughs> I've seen high speed drifts. Here it comes. <laughs> Chevalli. Spango, eh? Spango! Oh, yeah. That's a monster. Look at that. Absolute crack. It's probably 60, 65 centimeter. Spangled Emperor on the plastic. Beautiful colors, yeah. On a two ounce jig head, but he's macked. The plastic. Just got back from the jigging session. We managed that one big spangled that we kept and a couple Mary Rats that we let go. But we're going for one more dive before we leave. So it's just Jed and Josh, two dive buddies. Fingers crossed we can get some fish. Looks like a big mullet, bro. Bro, it just towed me around so hard. Just got back, got yeah, the tender yeah, on the yeah, roof. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Suppose he hates that song. Josh shot a big milk fish. I think that's what it Anyone is. in the comments know what they taste like, let us know. Suppose they don't taste very good, and I got a little coral trout. On board with the feet. Beautiful, mate. Oh, he's had a bit of a scar there. Yeah, he's been shot before or something similar, but he survived, and then I came and cleaned him up. Any fish? Yeah. Show us. Oh, oh, we didn't oh what'd you get? We got enough fish. We got a Spangled Emperor. He got a Goliath Groper. Oh, it was like, bro. Yeah. 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 Oh, boys went well as well. Well, that wraps up our trip to the Great Barrier Reef, but it's not over yet. We're just steaming in to Airlie Beach. We're actually on our way to Whitehaven Beach. We want to stay there for a couple of days. And yeah, I mean, fishing, diving, the Great Barrier Reef is great, but there's more to this area than just the reef. So we've had enough fishing and diving, and we're going to steam and do some more touristy stuff and see the more tourist attractions because I've always wanted to do that but haven't had the chance to but yeah we had an awesome time out of the reef but yeah we'll start drinking some beers and we've got a few rods out as well so if we hook up you guys will see that if we don't then we'll just keep drinking beer and we'll see you when you get in there Woo. <laughs> 
his camera shot. No, I'm not yelling. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Good morning and welcome to Whitehaven Beach on Whitsundale Island. It's absolutely beautiful. It's a beautiful day here. Heaps of boats mooring up. Someone clogged the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't me. I do want to do the walk that goes up on the lookout there. It just looks down Whitehaven Beach. <laughs> what are we doing, Toby? Mate, we're going on a beautiful walk with Sunday Islands. Going up to a lookout. <laughs> so, me and the boys have come over. We're going to try and catch a GT or something similar against the rocks. Might we'll just wake our way down there. We'll see how we go. GT would be pretty good. I don't think any of us have caught a GT before, so. Cast some stick baits and poppers and stuff and see how we go. First fish, I just pulled up here, I said it's 19 meters, the boys can jig and a couple will throw stick baits. I'm calling a little, I don't even know, eh? a little trout maybe? First cast. As soon as I hit the water, bro. I literally hit it on the top. What are you calling, mate? Some type of trev. Pull on the tinny. Big, it's real big. Oh, color. Oh, oh, get him, has get him, has. Oh, we're on. Hit the surface one pump, and it just got smacked. They call him Mr. One Pump for a reason. Oh. What the hell? I've got a bit better setup. Heavier braid. Oh, it's full of tin. That was sick. Good colour down there. Oh, yep. It's a trip. It's a banger. Is it? GT! Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! Yeah, baby! First GT off the top. Oh, boy! Yeah. <laughs> Are you, you kidding tail him? me? Are you kidding me? Yours is actually the GT, mate. Oh. Little bang off the top. Yee hoo! First JT. Yee hoo! Absolutely whack the stick bait. Let's get a healthy release on him. He ain't grunting. He'll be too keen to spear him. Oh! 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 oh. I'm yeah. on. I'm on. Lock it, lock it, lock it. You gotta lock it. Pump him, Tobes. <laughs> lock it up. Oh! Can we get a double? Keep filming, keep filming. Try and get a double. I'm gonna need to drive us off there. Is that a ball? Oh, that's a 
Camping tires. Oh! Yeah! Oh, at the boat. That's a queenie. Massive queenie. What? Is that a Spanish? No, queenie. That's massive. We saw it come and eat it at the boat. Are you kidding? That had like 10 slots oh. at it. Are you kidding? Yeah, totally. Lock it up. Lock it up. <laughs> He's coming. That is a massive queenie. <laughs> that is huge, bro. Is it? That's if a that's queenie. a queenie, that is huge. It's a queenie. Oh my god. <laughs> Toby's onto a huge queenie. Oh. <sighs> Hold my breath. Oh. <laughs> bro, just tire him yep. out. Come around the left. Come around the left. He's still pretty green, just tire him out on the surface. <sighs> That was so sick. Grab him. <laughs> yeah, Tommy! Yeah! yeah, boys! <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. So that is a stonker queen fish. Wow. That came up and literally just had two swipes at it. I quickly grabbed my GoPro and then by the time it started filming, he was on. Toby with a stonker queenie. We'll get him back, just take a couple photos. Beam in the gills, but hopefully he'll be all right. Straight back. Off he goes. Yes! Josh is on Wait, again. Up at him. He's gonna razz me in the reef. Drive up on him. Get on him, get on him. So on, hold that, hold that, hold that. One, one. Don't go too hard, Josh. Just... You, you've got him up. Get some ground on him. Drive up on him, man. Hold on. I am. Oh, yeah, GT, yeah. GT. Hold on his back, Harry. Just hold on his back. Just make sure he's in the reef. No! Drive up it's on him. Right. He's got me in the reef. Oh, slow, 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 slow. No, you got him out. Oh! There was GTs or something just at Queenies the boat. Queenies. Behind Toby's lure. There's one under the boat. We'll chuck the jig. Oh, <laughs> I oh. knew it. I said, grab the jig. Oh, oh. no. Small fish. Oh, Queenie. <laughs> Tiny little Queenie. It jumps so high. Oh, there's one following it. There's one following Put the jig down. Oh, oh. Queenie. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Got the crane as a rope swing off the top. See a fat reversal. Our second last day in the Whit Sundays, but you can't complain when it looks this good. Probably see you guys tomorrow on our last day in the Whit Sundays. Good morning, it's our last day here. We leave tomorrow. But absolutely beautiful morning at Whitehaven Beach, absolute glass off. Just had a skirt out and I was inside. I was waiting out here for a while. I was surprised we hadn't put the fish on the stroll yet. Do you need a gimbal, mate? Oh, maybe, yeah. TLD 25 was crazy. Thank you, mate. Please go get the flying gas. Feels <laughs> <laughs> tuner. A little beach. You might have that back. Still miss anyway. <laughs> you want her back? Yeah, I'll see you later. Back to it. Mac to it. Oh, it's a swarmy. <laughs> <laughs> oh! oh! <laughs> That's what we wanted. Good Quick release for the boys. Not many other beautiful right. spots than these. <laughs> Righto, we are back at Airly Beach. We're staying out here for the night, but basically it's our last day. Tomorrow we're leaving on the plane. I want to say a big thank you to Paul, my hope you uncharted. I'll give you a hug, mate. This is the second trip. Second trip. <laughs> Second trip with Paul and it was great as always. Got out to the reef which was just amazing. I love the reef out there and spit some good fish. Want to say congratulations to Josh. Get a hug too, eh? For winning the competition, bring Adam. Both for having us. No worries. Both did Paulie. <laughs> Both legends. Both legends. 
And yeah, it was good that they won. I know Josh has been following for a while. He only won because someone else couldn't come who actually won the trip, so I redrew and Josh pretty won. Pretty lucky, pretty lucky. Yeah, a bit of an essay, but <laughs> <laughs> good bloke at hard. I want to say thanks to Saxon no worries. and Ethan, both great yeah, deckies. I want to say thanks to Jed. Cheers, mate. Toby, Thanks, man. and Josh behind the camera for coming. I gave them the invite for a free trip and they couldn't say no, obviously, going out to the reef. But yeah, I want to say thanks to you guys watching at home because you guys make this possible. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed these two episodes. It was awesome being out there, spearfishing new fish. I know a lot of people ticked off new fish and PBs, so it was great. But anyway, thanks again, Paul, for hoping Uncharted, and I'll see you next time. Say hey, Toby. Hey, brah. <laughs> hey, guys. Oh, on the scenes, man. <laughs> you. <laughs> but the good news is about this trip, you lost what? My virginity. Thank you very much. Have a good day. <laughs> Ladies. <laughs> and we're hooked up. Number two. We got this monster. <laughs> <laughs> No way! <laughs> wait, wait, we'll show them. We'll show them. <laughs> what sort of fish is that, mate? Can you talk us through what you got? This is how to cook ramen for Perry.